All right guys so this time I'm staying with the Adagio Apart Hotels so Adagio is located in Amstelveen which is 5 km from the main city center Amsterdam and uh, Adagio is part of the Eco group so I'm a member of the Eco group and I prefer to stay with this brand for most of my travel so let's quickly go to the reception area so there is a flight of stairs that take you to the reception area but before that let me quickly show you the fountain which is inside the campus of this hotel now yeah okay so the reception unit is quite green as you see and then it has nicely set up of you know uh, melting candles and these candles kind of uh, provide a very nice fragrance so as you enter the reception you get a very nice fragrance this is the elevator area so i'm staying on the 6th floor so let's wait for the elevator to come down and then we will go to the floor and explore the room. All right, it is here. Let's get inside. I'm staying on the 6th floor. You have to you know, beep your card to go get onto the floor. And the beauty of this hotel, they have a gym which is 24/7 open. They do a weekly cleaning. Hmm. Let's wait for the sixth floor. All right, here we go. So I'm on my floor, and this is the lobby that takes me to the room. Very neat and clean. All right, I'm here at my room. Let's open it and explore. All right guys so let's start the room tour so right now in front of you what you see is the living area so this is approximately a 50 square meter kind of apartment uh, and this apartment has been split in multiple units so the first unit that we are seeing is the living area the living area has a beautiful couch okay which is the place where i relax most of the time whether it's watching tv or doing my office work or sometimes even reading books okay what I like about this place is this beautiful lampshade that you see is kind of curved. You can adjust it according to your need and you know use it the way you want to use it for even for your video recordings uh, or reading a book or anything you know, of that sort. And then what you see is a window, big window in front of this uh, living area and a television which is just at the center of the living room. Okay. So this is another, you know, way I spend my time watching some serials or even, you know, plug in my HDMI cable and watch some, you know, YouTube videos on, on the TV. Now, along with the living room is attached an open kitchen. Okay, so this is a fully equipped kitchen with all that you need okay, to cook as you live in this long stay apartment. Now, at has a beautiful dining area sweet and you know very petite okay with two nice tools and then what i like about this is this nespresso machine that i'm going to show you right away just a minute yeah and this is my morning you know uh, drink okay i put a pouch inside it and it brews me a very nice coffee every day 
Now the bedroom is also equipped with a television so one can watch the TV while they are under the blanket. But I hardly do that so most of the time I would watch my TV on the, in the living area. Now it also has a nice big mirror and a lot of storages where one can keep all with their you know, stuff and all. So I've kept some of mine as you see at a distance. Uh, now the uh, bedroom area as I said okay has this uh, nice storage attached to it. Okay, so right in front of what you see is a storage area. Alright so the next unit that we are going to see is the bedroom. So the bedroom is kind of equipped with a big size bed. I believe it's a twin size with a couple of you know pillows and a nice thick warm blanket which keeps me very warm towards the night. It also has two side stands, okay, and lamps, okay, which allows me to charge my mobile and switch on the light in the dark if I need to. And what I like about this bedroom is a wonderful big window that's opened up to the street view. So a lot of greeneries which gives my eyes very soothing early in the morning as I watch them. And this tall buildings that you see right opposite to the uh, hotel. These are the student areas and a lot of cars are parked on the streets as you see. Now here I here I heard that every car needs a permit from the town hall before they can park in a specific area in a residential uh, locality. So they have the special permits. The sky today is kind of very gloomy. Uh, I believe it. Alright, so let's have a quick look at the shower area. So the shower area is two parts. Okay. The first one that you see is a basin area where you can use it for your uh, brushing and shaving and others. It has a beautiful nice mirror. And next to the mirror you also have a sm small mirror which allows you to take a enlarged view of your face and uh, what you want to see. <laughs> and uh, then uh, let's have a look at the shower region. So the shower region has you know it's quite big honestly and then it has a head shower which is at the top and then it has a you know, hand shower which can be used the best part of it is it's kind of operated by a switch so the switch is towards the right that you see I will operate it a little bit and show it to you roughly so there are two options so if you want to switch on the hand shower and the other one is to switch on the head shower Let's switch on the hand shower. Okay, as you see it started, and then I switch it off. Isn't it beautiful? Okay, so most of the time you get 24-7 hot water. So whatever you need, you just turn accordingly and just go. Alright, finally the toilet area. So I don't know what more to show here, but it's just equipped with a western toilet, okay, and it is just next to the shower area.